This is what subway looks like in Kunming. This is a high-speed railroad in Kunming. This is riding a bus in Kunming. Big bus. This is downtown Kunming. Um, cargo underneath in the tunnel and people only on above. This was actually look like um, in downtown where tunnel is underneath. That's the only car you can see. This is Kumi. We have more than 26 ethnic uh, minority groups in the province, which makes this place really unique. Great food and everything. This is a e-bike with a monk riding it. Uh, this is me riding the bus where you can see so many e-bikes in the city. And you, the e-bikes get the VIP uh, bike path on almost every single street in the town. And that's the uh, share bike, which is really popular recently. Uh, Wall Street Journal did a really good video here. Traffic jams have long been a problem in China's big cities like Beijing and Shanghai. Now, some Chinese entrepreneurs are hoping to turn that into a new business. Bike sharing. OFO Bicycle and Mobike are two of the major players competing to convince Chinese consumers to cycle instead of drive. Together, the two companies have a fleet of hundreds of thousands of bikes in Beijing and Shanghai. And unlike bike rentals in most cities, you can use your smartphone to operate them. OFO targets students with cheap yellow bikes, some of which are secondhand. Users scan a QR code, enter the bike's license plate number, and then they receive a code for the keypad lock via text message. Well, amazing. Well, you see the footage here, the problem with China is too many people. You can just abandon the bike there, and so there's more regulation needed. Well, let's talk about WeChat, the super app. The greatest example of this is WeChat. WeChat is an example of, uh, for lack of a better word, a super app. It's a Swiss army knife that basically does everything for you. It's your WhatsApp, Facebook, Skype, and Uber. It's your Amazon, Instagram, Venmo, and Tinder. But it's other things we don't even have apps for. There are hospitals that have built out whole appointment booking systems. There are investment services. There are even heat maps that show how crowded a place is, be it your favorite shopping mall or a popular tourist site. The list of services goes on basically forever. Well, here is a actual demo I was doing for you guys. Um, so this is the WeChat homepage. You got all the contacts, chattings. This is a subscription, news right here, other articles. Um, that's all your contacts. Um, discover page moments, which is more like a Facebook or Instagram to get their uh, mini programs, crazy stuff. Um, here, you, if you click wallet, which is actual, you know, wallet on your phone. Here, this page is, you know, the service that I can get, I can use WeChat to do in Kunming City. You know, service go on and on, bike sharing, order taxi, food, you know, railroad, flights, hotel. Thank you for watching. I think Kunming is smart because of the things I mentioned. All the work I cited is in the description down below. You can find it over there. Thank you.